Most cars are designed to last maybe 150,000 to 200,000 miles. But some drivers push their cars beyond a million. So what separates the cars that die early from the ones that live almost forever? In this video, you'll discover 13 hidden practices mechanics rarely talk about that can double or even triple your car's life expectancy. The difference isn't luck, it's specific discipline choices. If you've ever wondered why some cars seem bulletproof while others collapse after just a decade, you're about to see the secret playbook. Number one, oil and filters. A single skipped oil change can quietly shave years off your car's life, yet most people push it off, thinking one missed on service won't matter. The truth is, every mile your engine runs depends on a thin film of oil separating metal parts that move thousands of times per minute. Without it, those surfaces grind like sandpaper, creating wear that never reverses. Think of it like blood in your body. If circulation slows or worse, clots form, the system begins breaking down. Oil works the same way. Over time, it collects dirt, carbon, and tiny fragments of metal. That's why the filter is just as important. It's the gatekeeper that ensures only clean oil flows through the heart of the engine. When either is ignored, sludge builds up, passages clog, and heat skyrockets. Plenty of drivers stretch intervals by reminding themselves that engines are stronger than they used to be. But when you look at cars that regularly reach or exceed the 300,000 mile mark, one common thread always shows up. They never gambled on late oil changes. Owners who stuck to their schedules gave their engines the clean lifeblood they needed to survive. Neglect often ends in blown gaskets, warped pistons, or even complete engine failure, repairs that can total a car. On the other hand, simply replacing oil and filters on time costs far less and protects the engine's future. And once your engine stays healthy, another hidden protector comes into play, the coolant that defends it against heat. Number two, coolant. Engines don't usually die of old age. They most often fail from overheating and the root cause is usually neglected or incorrect coolant. Your car's cooling system isn't just about preventing the temperature gauge from spiking. Coolant has two main jobs, draw heat away from the engine so it doesn't seize, and guard against corrosion building up inside metal passages where you can't see the damage forming. Here's where many drivers make a critical mistake. Instead of topping up with the proper coolant their car was designed to use, They'll pour in plain tap water or a universal mix. It seems harmless at first, but minerals in tap water form scale that clogs radiators, while the wrong formulas can actually eat away at seals and water pumps. What starts as a cheap shortcut can spiral into a blown head gasket, the kind of failure that costs thousands and often ends a car's life early. Manufacturers design their coolants with specific additives to protect aluminum, iron, and even the delicate rubber parts that keep the system sealed. Using the wrong stuff strips away that protection. Once corrosion takes hold, leaks develop, pumps fail, and the engine overheats more easily. That one choice, to ignore the recommended coolant, creates a domino effect across the entire engine's lifespan. The smart move is simple. Stick with the exact coolant type listed in your manual. Doing that preserves the engine's circulatory system for decades. And once heat is under control, attention shifts to the tires, which face constant punishment every mile you drive. Number three, the rotation secret. What if ignoring tire rotation quietly shortens the life of your suspension system too? Most people think rotation is only about squeezing a few extra miles from tread, but the truth is it goes much deeper. Tires don't wear evenly on their own. The front pair handles steering, cornering, and braking, while the rear mostly follows along. Over thousands of miles, that difference creates uneven patterns that throw the car's balance off. By rotating tires at the right intervals, wear gets spread out so all four age at the same pace, keeping not just the tires but also the alignment and suspension under less strain. Think about it like shoes. If you only ever wore one on your left foot, it would break down much faster than the right. Pretty soon, your walk would be uneven and your body would begin to ache. Cars respond the same way. Uneven tires place extra tension on shocks, bearings, and joints. That stress shortens their lifespan, turning a simple missed rotation into much larger repair bills you could have avoided. 
Tire rotations create ripple effects across the car, reducing hidden wear everywhere. And once your tires stay balanced, attention shifts to your brakes, where another kind of silent damage is building. Number four, brake fluid. Brake failure often starts with something you can't see, dirty brake fluid. Unlike oil or coolant, it doesn't burn off or splash out where you'd notice a problem. Instead, brake fluid quietly absorbs small amounts of moisture over the months and years. Once water's inside the system, metal brake lines begin corroding from within, long before you ever see a leak on the floor. That corrosion weakens the lines and begins reducing the hydraulic power needed to stop the car. The trouble is most drivers believe that if the brakes feel firm or stop the vehicle, everything is fine. But by the time you notice a spongy pedal or longer stopping distances, damage has already eaten away at the system. Imagine microscopic rust forming inside a narrow line. Piece by piece, the passage shrinks, and under pressure, tiny fragments break loose. Those particles can jam delicate valves in modern ABS pumps, turning a smooth safety feature into a repair bill worth thousands. By replacing fluid before it gets dirty, you eliminate that hidden moisture, protect critical parts, and keep braking power strong for many more years. Once the system breathes freely, the next focus is on the engine's lungs, the air filter. Number five, air filter. Imagine forcing yourself to run a marathon while breathing through a clogged mask that's your engine on a dirty air filter. Every second the engine runs, it pulls in large volumes of air to mix with fuel. And that mixture has to be clean if combustion is going to work properly. When the filter is fresh, air flows freely, fuel burns evenly, and the engine runs at its designed efficiency. When it's blocked with dust, pollen, or debris, combustion struggles, power drops, and the entire system is forced to work harder than it should, a lot of drivers assume an old filter only knocks a mile or two off their fuel economy, but that thinking ignores the long-term damage. Tiny particles that squeeze past a clogged or neglected filter are abrasive. They act exactly like sandpaper, etching grooves into cylinder walls and wearing piston rings. Over time, those microscopic scratches grow into visible damage, and once that happens, oil consumption rises, compression falls, and the engine's life shortens dramatically. Keeping filters clean is essentially giving your car healthy lungs that can breathe for decades without strain. And once the airways are protected, the next hidden lifeline moves inside to transmission fluid. Number six, transmission fluid. Most transmissions seem to fail out of nowhere, but the truth is the damage began years earlier. Inside every automatic transmission, fluid is the only thing preventing constant friction between moving parts. It carries away heat, keeps gears lubricated, and maintains the precise hydraulic pressure needed for smooth shifts. Without clean, properly checked fluid, the entire system slowly wears down long before you ever notice a problem. The issue is that most drivers never check it. They assume it's lifetime fluid, or that it doesn't need attention until they see slipping gears or strange noises. By then, it's too late. Replacing clogged fluid costs less than a night out, while a rebuild can cost three to $6,000, often more than the value of the car itself. That's why mechanics say transmission fluid to gears is what oil is to the engine. It's the lifeline they can't survive without. Skipping this step is one of the costliest gambles you can take with your car. Checking often and changing on time is the difference between decades of reliable driving and a sudden expensive breakdown. And after protecting the transmission, another silent killer waits, corrosion underneath the body. Number seven, rust. Cars rarely die because the engine quits. They usually die when the body rusts away. Corrosion eats through frames, brake lines, and fuel systems quietly until one day the structure is too far gone to repair. Unlike an engine problem, rust spreads even when the car is parked, especially in climates where salt and moisture are part of everyday driving. That's why undercarriage care is not optional if you want the vehicle to last decades. The undercarriage takes the biggest hit because salt, dirt, and water collect on hidden surfaces. Frames, mounting points, and even fuel lines trap that grime. And over time, it creates corrosion that spreads like a disease. Washing the paint might make a car look nice on the outside, 
but it does almost nothing for the parts underneath carrying the real load. Preventing it is surprisingly straightforward. Regular undercarriage washes, especially during winter, remove the buildup before it has time to harden and corrode. Protective coatings or sprays add another layer of defense, creating a barrier against moisture. Number eight, the inflation factor. A few forgotten PSI in your tires quietly drains your wallet and slowly wrecks your suspension. It doesn't sound like much, but running just a few pounds low creates more rolling resistance, which forces the engine to burn extra fuel for every mile. Over time, that adds up to dozens of wasted fill-ups. At the same time, deflated tires flex more on each rotation, heating up faster and stressing suspension components that were never designed to handle the extra load. A tire can be 10 PSI low and still appear full to the naked eye. Those small leaks or uneven pressures create hidden stress that slowly spreads through shocks, bushings, and steering parts. Think of it like running in shoes with one sole thicker than the other. Your knees and hips feel it first, even if your stride looks normal. Regular manual checks keep damage from starting in the first place. Correct inflation protects more than rubber, it preserves suspension, fuel efficiency, and safety. And once the tires are stable, the next factor waiting to decide your engine's fate is timing. Number nine, timing belts and chains. A snapped timing belt is like a snapped spine for your engine. It may never recover. The belt or chain has one critical role. It keeps the crankshaft and camshaft turning in perfect synchronization. Every valve opening, every piston stroke, depends on that exact rhythm. If the timing breaks, the entire sequence collapses instantly. Many owners play roulette with this part, stretching it past the recommended interval because the car still runs smoothly. The danger is that the belt usually shows no obvious signs before failure. Chains can stretch over time and belts can weaken invisibly until the moment they give way. This becomes catastrophic in interference engines, which make up a large share of modern vehicles. In those engines, pistons and valves share the same space at different times. When the timing slips, pistons slam into valves at full speed. The math is simple. Replacing a timing belt costs a few hundred dollars in parts and labor. Waiting too long can trigger a failure that easily exceeds two or three thousand dollars, sometimes writing off the entire car. Number 10. Dashboard lights. Every warning light is your car whispering a secret. It's a plea before a scream. Those icons aren't random symbols put there to annoy you. They're designed to alert you the moment something starts going wrong, often before you'd ever feel it while driving. A check engine light that blinks today could be pointing to a failing sensor, a misfire, or a leak. Things that cost little to repair right away but spiral into expensive damage if ignored. Yet people dismiss them all the time. Some cover the light with tape, others convince themselves it's just a glitch. The danger is that small problems don't stay small. A $30 oxygen sensor might seem harmless, but when left unchecked, it can cause the catalytic converter to overheat and fail. Suddenly you're staring at a $3,000 repair. The good news, you don't need to visit a mechanic every time a light turns on. Affordable diagnostic readers exist today that cost less than a single tank of gas. With a quick plug-in, you can see exactly what the code means often in under a minute. Number 11, warm-up rituals. Most engine wear doesn't happen while you're speeding down the highway. It happens in the very first seconds after a cold start. When the engine is off overnight, oil settles back into the pan. On startup, it takes several seconds for that oil to circulate fully, leaving metal parts running against each other with far less protection. During this short window, microscopic damage occurs every single time. Cold temperatures make the problem worse. Metal parts contract in the cold, shrinking slightly out of their ideal tolerances. They only expand back to proper clearances once the engine warms. Mechanics consistently point out that driving gently for the first few minutes is the single best habit in cold weather. Fleet operators in northern states actually schedule warm-up routines because they've seen it extend service life across entire vehicle groups. The takeaway is simple. Restraint in those first miles is what separates cars that thrive from those that wear out too soon. From hidden habits behind the wheel, the next code shifts to how your car is stored when it's parked. Number 12, shade versus sunlight. 
Believe it or not, the sun does more damage to cars than many accidents ever will. Every hour of direct exposure slowly breaks down the very materials holding your car together. Paint oxidizes, clear coats dull, and interiors fade like old fabric left outside. Over the years, heat from the sun doesn't just discolor surfaces. It dries and cracks dashboards, weakens rubber seals, and makes plastics brittle until they lose their shape. What some drivers see as just cosmetic spreads into damage that shortens the entire car's lifespan. Real data shows vehicles kept in shaded storage hold their value longer and require fewer interior repairs simply because the environment was kinder to them. The solution isn't complicated or costly. Parking in a garage is ideal, but even a shaded driveway slows the process dramatically. Sunshades protect dashboards from direct beams, while car covers add a shield against UV rays when outdoor storage is the only option. Regular applications of wax or clear coat protection also help preserve paint depth. Number 13, the master code. If you follow no other rule, this one alone can add decades to your car's life. The most powerful secret isn't a product or a trick. It's simply sticking to the schedule your manufacturer gave you when the car was new. Those little charts in the manual aren't random suggestions. They're built from thousands of hours of stress tests, lab simulations, and real-world driving cycles. Every interval, whether it's fluids, filters, belts, or inspections, is chosen to prevent parts from failing before they cause major damage. The problem is many drivers treat that schedule as optional. They look at the list, pick the cheapest items, and push off the rest as if nothing will happen. At first, the car still runs, so the habit seems harmless. But just like skipping a medical checkup, the danger builds unseen. Small issues compound with mileage, and what could have been a quick fix turns into an expensive repair that usually arrives without warning. The truth is, this one principle ties every aspect of car care together. Following the manufacturer's schedule is the most reliable immortality code, proving that longevity isn't chance, it's choice. And that choice puts the power of decades-long ownership squarely in your hands. Cars don't simply die, they're neglected piece by piece until failure looks inevitable. Each of these codes shows that longevity isn't random. It's a decision you make every time you follow through on basic maintenance. Now here's the challenge. Adopt even half of these habits and you could add decades of life to your car while saving thousands in avoidable repairs. In a time where almost everything feels replaceable, your car doesn't have to be. Treat it as a long-term partner instead of something disposable and you'll realize that careful ownership is one of the smartest financial moves you can make. If this helped you make your cars last longer, tap like and subscribe for proven DIY tips. Be first to catch 13 mods that are worth it and five that kill your engine when it drops.